This is a common kind of Facebook scam, which is when you get a comment or a direct message from uh, from somebody who says, oh, they really like you, and you go to their profile, um, and uh, th in this case, this was this was common. This was somebody who's commenting on Katie Curtin's post, so I guess he's assuming that Katie um, would, is looking for men or whatever. But but uh, and what's even more interesting is that it's this is Katie who has written a legit recommendation on my business page. Thank you so much, Katie. And then this scammer is commenting on her review post. Anyway, if you go to this guy's profile, it looks like this. You know, how, how can you not like or trust a, uh, a decorated military veteran? Uh, and, oh, look, he's widowed, you know, and, and he has a heart here. And it's like, they do all kinds of things to make, to, to try to warm our hearts. And, and, you know, he has photos that look legit and, uh, you know, looks like such a nice guy, etc. But we know that this is a scammer because when we look on his profile, well, it, we're lucky enough to actually have someone saying, hey, why are you, posting you know weird friend requests and stuff but you if it's a real profile you typically see uh genuine conversations in the comments and you don't see any of that here plus just the request itself sounds to me anyway it's i'm i'm very used to the i've been on facebook so long so i've seen all kinds of scams this is very obvious to me uh, so what would happen if you actually followed through like if if katie didn't know and if katie actually messaged eric fake eric uh what would probably happen my guess, uh, from what I've seen is Eric, the fake Eric will try to build a friendship with Katie, uh, maybe even send other, you know, Eric Hill photos and try to build a, maybe even close to a relationship. And then eventually Eric will ask for money. Like, I really need help, you know, for whatever reason, you know, they, they, they'll, they'll make it sound really legit and sympathetic and all that stuff. So all I'm saying is, um, don't get taken by the stuff. And if it sounds too good to be true, uh, it probably is. <laughs> and if you have any other um, uh, related scams to report or unfortunate experiences to share or any other tips, please go ahead and comment below and help others out. Thank you uh, for watching and I hope this helps.